There's lots to see in Jaipur. Here's what I covered in two days. My hotel provided a driver and we headed towards the pink city. We stopped briefly at Hawa Mahal before driving to Amberfort. You can ride an elephant up to the fort. Amberfort is large and impressive. Allow two hours. Here are the fort's flower beds. Here's the wall leading up to Jaiga Fort, my next stop. Jaiga has the world's largest cannon on wheels. I got pretty close to some monkeys. The views are pretty impressive. Here's Amber Fort, you can see the size of it. My driver spotted these and we stopped, taking a break on the way back down from Jaiga. Quick photo opportunity in front of Jal Mahal. After lunch, went to the city palace. Pretty tired by the stage, still lots to see. Next to city palace was Janta Manta. It's very impressive. Last stop for the day was Albert Hall. I was more impressed by how it looked rather than what was inside it. Took some shots of the locals and surrounds. These kids asked to have their picture taken. That evening I used Uber to get to Chopidani and take in local culture. The next morning I used a rickshaw to get to the steps leading up to Nagara Fort. I met some locals at the top. I arrived before the fort opened so I had some time to kill. The palace didn't compare to Amber Fort, but it was still impressive. There were great views from the top. Here's the city palace in Janta Manta. My next stop was Garganesh Temple. I got to the road leading up by motorbike and ritual. It took maybe 20 minutes to walk up and the views were pretty stunning. By now it was around noon and it was time to head back down. Here's beautiful Gator. A fine place to be cremated. I spent the afternoon exploring the markets before heading off to the airport.